I'm going to go in depth on how cross save works on all platforms and we're going to start right now. What's up guys, Reckless here, welcome to Guardian Watcher. So today I want to talk about cross save and how it will actually work on all platforms. But before we get into the video, if you guys haven't already entered into the Destiny 2 Shadow Keep giveaway for the month of August 2019, then go ahead and sub to the channel, turn on notifications, follow me on Twitter, and also a link to the giveaway will be in the description box below. Real quick, let me know in the comment section if you have any questions after the video. So let's get this out of the way. Cross save is not the same as cross play. Cross save allows you to save your progress on one platform and be able to use that same account on a different platform. For example, if you are playing on an Xbox One by your lonesome, but all of your cool friends are actually on PC, then you can actually save your progress, go to your PC, and actually play with your friends. On the other hand, cross play allows you to play with your friends on different platforms. An example of cross play is that you are playing on your PC and your friends are playing the game with you on a console. Destiny 2 will be cross save, not cross play. Now that all of that is brought to light, let's talk about how this will actually work. All sources will be in the description box below and a few things aren't mentioned but I will elaborate for you guys. Let's go ahead and start with if you have two or more Destiny 2 accounts. When cross save goes live and you have more than one account, you will be prompted to choose one of the accounts to be your main or master account. This main or master account will be the only account that is allowed to use the cross save feature. Your other accounts will not be deleted, but it will get locked until you disable cross save on your main account. One important thing to note is that if you disable cross save after you have already enabled it, there will be a 30 day cooldown before you can re-enable cross save again. Also, you will not be able to merge your accounts. So, definitely make sure that whatever account you choose is the one with the most progression. Next, let's talk about cross save and changing platforms. If you are looking to change platforms from either console to PC or vice versa, you will need to rebuy Destiny 2 Forsaken, the annual pass, and or shadow keep if you want access to all of the content in those DLCs for the new platform. If you do not rebuy the DLCs, you will be limited to the content in Destiny 2 New Light. You will however have access to all of the weapons and armor you have earned on your original platform. All PC players will be moved from their Battle.net accounts to Steam within the next few weeks. All DLC purchased prior to the move to Steam for PC players will also move over with your account. Next, we're going to talk about Silver in Clans. We'll go ahead and start first with Silver. All Silver will be locked on the platform you purchase it on and it will not transfer, I will say it again, it will not transfer over to the new platform. Silver must be used on the platform that you purchased it on, but any items purchased with Silver will be able to be used on any platform. Any Silver that you bought on Battle.net will also transfer to Steam. As for clans, while cross save is active, you will not be able to join multiple clans. You can still change your clan one at a time, but you will not be able to join multiple clans on different platforms and you will only have access to your clan mates if you guys are actually playing on the same platform. However, all progression for clan rewards will be shared across all platforms. Now the post doesn't say it, but I'm pretty sure that all of your items will transfer over as well. This includes Bright Dust, Legendary Shards, Planetary Materials, all items, shaders, etc. that are in your inventory. And the same goes for everything that is in your vault. So that's pretty much how everything works for cross save. If you guys have any questions, definitely go ahead and let me know in the comment section below. And that my friends brings us to the end of the video. Toss a like on the video if you enjoyed it and feel free to watch these videos as well. Definitely get subscribed for more Destiny 2 content coming at you soon and I will see you guys in the next video.